We are in Kentucky. We left last night around 11 p.m. to um, make our way to Georgia. We're going to meet a new mermaid friend, Mermaid Jess. From there, go down to a mermaid meetup in Florida and hopefully join everyone for a swim on Friday. So, whew, it is Thursday afternoon. I was only supposed to stop and sleep for a couple hours and I reset my alarm for a couple more. So I'm definitely gonna be behind schedule now, but ultimately there's no real set schedule. We just um, are on our adventure. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't do anything before I left for the trip, but it was a snowy, cold world. Oh boy, do I look tired. I am. I seriously could go for a full night's sleep. But we have a nice big drive ahead of us, so. All right, we're gonna get everything closed up. Let Lily get out and uh, have a potty for the morning. Brush my hair. My glasses are crooked. <laughs> and uh, hopefully get us awake for the next part of the adventure. Potty. Having her morning potty. You can see I've got her attached to me. Oh, right down into the van. You gonna go potty? Go potty, love. <laughs> South Carolina, another state I didn't know I'd be visiting on this trip. My van's GPS is taking me a totally different route than what I researched. So welcome to South Carolina. We just crossed the border and left North Carolina and are continuing to head south. It's 1.25 in the morning and I finally arrived at Mermaid Jess's house. Um, we're tired. We've been driving since 11 p.m. last night well over 24 hours now. So we're here, but it's much too late to actually join her. I think we have only, yes, um, only three hours more to actually get to the springs. So I think that's what we're gonna do, but we're not even sure if we're at the right house. If this is your house, we were out in front of it for a moment. It looks like that might even be our spot to park in but we are gonna head to the springs and meet you there since you are sleeping, darling. Okay, we're gonna get on the road. Arrival time, 431 estimation. Of course, that's gonna, it always grows, right? Especially this trip, I'll tell you more about it later. But we ended up going through the Smoky Mountains and all over the place because 
I had no idea I was even gonna go through North Carolina and South Carolina. So it's been quite an adventure and took much longer than we originally anticipated. But since I'm sitting in a dark car, I will tell you more about that later. Okay, Mwah. Say good morning. Good morning, world. I am completely exhausted. Um, after 29 hours, a little more even, I think, driving yesterday, we finally stopped. Uh, we made it all the way to Alexander Springs last night, but well, 5 a.m. this morning, and they're closed until 8 a.m., so we just took a little rest, and it's just after 8, and we're going to go check it out. But we stayed at this place last night. I'm not even sure of the name of it. Thankfully, no one's come to work or anything yet, so we appreciate you guys uh, for hosting us without you even knowing. We're gonna go check this place out. I am so exhausted. You can see it in my eyes. I don't know if I really fully slept because I didn't know if I'd be waking up to some man knocking on the window or what. It's supposed to be really beautiful here, and so hopefully we can get some camping, I think, because I need a break. So, um... Anyways, we'll see what the next little bit unfolds. Let's go check this place out during the day. Okay, more soon. All right. So this is where we camped last night. Thankfully, it's still nice and quiet here. There's even an old plane. See that? It was called the Castaway Restaurant and Bar. Thank you, Castaways, for a little night's sleep. All right, it looks like had it been Saturday or Sunday, they're now serving breakfast from 8 a.m. to 11. So, lucky us, it is a Friday. Are we ready? Let's go check this place out. In one and a quarter miles, turn left. Springs Recreation Area. 